Hi guys, I'm James. Today, today I show you a new product. That is the Ford Scan Pro. Special design for the Ford cars, and I got it from Amazon about around the 14 bucks, 40 bucks. Okay. Uh, here is the the card. Here, firstly, you can see you can download the software from the software.fordscan.net and uh, just uh, follow the steps, follow the instructions and install the drivers and the, the software. Anyway, it's a uh, very easy way. Okay. Here's the hardware device. You can see this device without uh, the HS or MS switcher and this uh, OBD2 16 pins and with uh, LED and here is the USB cable. Now we connect to the OBD2 port here. And you can see here right now the LED is not on because the device is powered on by the USB port. Once I connect to the USB, to the lab, laptop USB, here you can see the LED on the device is on right now. We have already pre-installed the full scan software based on the Windows 10 platform, the operating system, Windows 10. Okay, you can see here. After you install the software and uh, as well as the, the driver, you can find, go to the this PC manager. You can choose device manager. And you can choose the ports here. You can see the US20 CH340 COM6, which means hardware driver is already installed. We go to the full scan, open it. The first thing you have to do is setting the, go to the settings, connection, and choose. This is very important. ELM327 specific, MS can support. We must choose the RTS relay. Okay, we choose this one. And then we go back, choose the connect to vehicle. It's already read out, read out the adapter version or something. We choose any, any of them, choose OK. It's reading the vehicle modules right now. The IPC or something. You can see some of the additional the Ford information stacks and the ABS, some arrows. All the arrows here. If you want to delete all the arrows, just uh, choose this one. Reset DTC. Or you can just read the DTC again by click this icon. The lab data. You can go to the scope read PID data here, click this one and you can choose options and add, add any anyone you want. You want to add all of them, just uh, press here the keyboard, press shift, press insert and choose anyone you want and choose the red arrow we add to the lab data and then uh, click the start. It will automatically read out the lab data structures here. For the coding pro programming function, you can use the uh, configuration and the programming.